In a day of science, why do we even have faith? So someone wrote to me on my page the other day that said that in a day of science, we know that Helios doesn't drive his chariot across the sky. Why do you even switch from a main religion, basically, that is just maybe even sillier than what is main religion? Because you know that Helios doesn't drive his chariot across the sky. And we know this. <laughs> We're not delusional. Um, we know that the seasons don't change because Persephone goes to the underworld. We don't. We know this is true, but there is a thing we don't see behind it. There's a spiritual force behind what operates the world, and that's what we believe in. And it takes personal experience to actually really find faith in what is not seen. I always go back to Family Matters, the TV show where Urkel... Steve Urkel, he gets religion, and he had the same conversation with his family, his parents, because you know Steve Urkel is the nerdy science kid, and of course his parents are scientists, and they asked him when Urkel found religion, why do you believe that in the science world? In the day of science, why, why do I have faith in something like that? And I think back on that, and I think that it's the same argument that we can't see the oxygen we're breathing, but we know that it exists. We can't see the gods physically, but we know it exists for the same reason, experience. And like I said, it's something that you have to experience to really understand, like most things in life. And there are people that um, don't want to experience things because they have an eye of skepticism. And there are people that do want to and they just can't find it. But just because they can't find it doesn't mean it doesn't exist. So there's no real point in arguing with people that already have their minds set. Um, especially with a snarky attitude. Because there's no reason to argue because they already have their minds set on certain things. So to people that say that, you know, Helios doesn't drive his chariot across the sky. We know this. But that doesn't take away from the spirit behind what makes things work in our universe. And that's what we believe and are thankful for. Anyway, guys, I hope this video helped you out. And I'll talk to you later. Bye.